All right, YouTube, welcome back to He Was Helpful. I hope you guys have a great day. Mine's going pretty well. It's awfully cold. I don't know if you can see this, but uh, it's cold. I can see my breath. So, um, anyways, I'm not sure if you guys know this about Cadillacs, but since I have a DeVille, I happen to know it, and I'm going to share it with you today. If you got an engine light on, you need to read your codes. You don't need expensive gadgets and scanners and stuff like that. You don't even need your blow from the auto parts store, all right? You can do this on your own. You can look up the codes. You know where I'm going with this. But before we get into it, you know we in Michigan, right? So it's cold out here. And I want everybody to really recognize how cold cold is. So I'm going to show you all right quick. Check this out. This is for my folks back in North Carolina. I think they know what snow is. Check it. Yeah. That's snow. And that's cold. Slipping and sliding in that joint this morning. Felt real good. Psych. Anyway. Man, look at the HHR back there. Boy, she chilly. Let's go. So, first thing we do, start the car. I'll be right. Alright. Got that Kodak going. Alright, guys. So, here's what we're going to do. Over here, you have an info button with an up and down arrow and an on and off button as well. Now, we're gonna touch these two buttons together simultaneously and hold them down. When we do that, we get this little weird looking joint going on. All those, all right, we let it go. It's gonna say all. Now, you use your info up and down button and you just scroll through. These are different types of codes referring to different areas of the vehicle. All right, so PCM, we don't have any codes on this vehicle at the moment, so it's not like we're really going to pull anything up. But I just want to show you how you can go specifically into each one. Let's take a gander at this just to check it. So when you select it, you want to hit on off. All right, see we have a history code. <laughs> history means that it happened, but it cleared itself out quickly, so it just stores it in history, doesn't keep it as a current code. All right, we're going to clear all codes. Same way we did, hit the on off button. ABS codes clear. All right, now when we want to go back to our regular screen, we can either turn the car off or we just give this a few touches and it'll go right back down to where it's supposed to be. Look at my baby getting old. 132,000 miles. It's sad, but she's still strong, though. All right, guys. Like I said, hopefully this can help you out. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe. I'll see you soon.